Just another another personal goal that uh, I accomplished in my in my life, and just adding to my resume, and just trying to be the best player I can be. That's that's pretty much what this means to me, and you know, it's a proud moment for me. Like we got we got a very unselfish team, you know, starting with uh, you know our guards, uh, Pefi and Milos. You know, they share the ball so well, and you know, Milos can also score so well. So. But I love how he shared the ball so well and try to balance scoring and, you know, getting us involved. So it's it's been a good year and we're such an unselfish team that, you know, I think it could have been anybody on our team winning top 16 MVP. I don't think, you know, anything happened or anything. Just, you know, I'm very comfortable with my role this year. You know, I got back, you know, that's my second year with the team and with coach, my third year with the with coach, of course. And, you know, I'm just very comfortable. I know what he you know, rely on me for it and I know what he wants for me and you know I'm I'm real comfortable with playing under him right now. Uh I didn't know like it was such a big deal. You know, I was just playing, you know, just trying to play hard and do what I can for the team. You know, and we end up getting a win and I still was kind of like, yeah, I don't think I played like a very good like that good of a game. But then you know, you know, media always, you know, kind of hype it up that you know I didn't miss anything, any free throws. So I really never looked at it as as such a big deal. But now I'm realizing like, yeah, it was something, you know, something good, something great. <laughs> yeah, it's not, it, it wasn't difficult to adjust the plan with him, of course, but because he's, you know, uh, you know, he's going to tell you exactly what he wants and exactly how he's going to get the ball to you. And it's just been times we've been in mid game and he'd be like, look, this is what I want for you. And the ball is going to be right there. And Literally the next play, it'd be right there. And, you know, I just either have to finish or make the right play. So he, he kind of uh, kind of teaches us kind of how to play with him, I guess you can say, and how to learn learn from him. And, you know, I'm a student of the game. So anytime he opened up his mouth, it's kind of like, you know, I kind of shut up and listen and see what, you know, what he sees. I've been, of course, I've been watching him since, you know, he's been in you know, pretty much his, his whole EuroLeague career. So I, I've known of him. I've known he's always been like a, a great, great player, but he still amazes me. Like, you know, just, you know, certain things that he, how he passes the ball in practice and just certain moments, I'd be like, dang, that's like, he's he, he's a really good, great player. Like, <laughs> like I'm still amazed with just the little stuff he do in practice and in the games. Yeah, we just talking about that. Like, it's a lot of tradition here, a lot of winning here, a lot of great players that came through this, uh, this, this system and this team. And you know, that's it, that that that's a big a big thing when you're deciding what team you want to play for. Like, you know, you want to play for that culture, that 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 winning, that that type of winning organization. And I think it's a, it's a good place for us this year to try to get some more. Right. Medals. Just going going into each game with the mindset of, you know, we're ready to play. The, we know we know why we're here, and you know we're gonna give it our all. And I feel like that definitely should be enough. If we just play hard, that definitely would, would just be enough on top of everything else we have, because we have so many uh, veteran players, experienced players that been in these situations and literally been in every situation in your league and in the NBA. So, you know, we're, we're kind of special like that. So, you know, when it comes down the line, I really, you know, some people get real nervous. I, I get real, I'm real confident because we have Peffy, Milos, Belly, Kyle Williams, who's vet, uh, a veteran who's been playing, you know, who's been on good teams before and they've been in these moments. So I, I get real confident because I know, you know, Somebody on our team is going to be able to knock down a good shot. But that's, that's been our number one goal since we've been recruited last year. And, you know, unfortunately it happened, what happened last year, you know, it happened for everybody. So you really can't complain about it, really can't, you know, regret it or anything. But this year, you know, we definitely just got to take care of business. And, you know, like I said, going, going to each series and each game with the, the same mindset and that's, we're going to outwork everybody and we're just going to play hard. Cause like I said, if we just take care of that, that two aspects of the game on top of everything else that we have, I feel like that'll put us over the top.